Okay, boys, got a little bit of surf to deal with today. Beautiful offshore wind kind of day, very nice out. Surf's around two to three foot. Just got to pick the right time. Shouldn't be too bad. It's a little chilly, so I hope I don't get too wet. Let's see how it goes down. Hey guys, what is happening? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another exciting episode of Lost Horizon Fishing. Well, today is February 7th. It's a Monday and it is a very special day. What day is it, might you ask? Hey boys, it's my birthday. I am 69 years old today and still going strong, or at least reasonably strong. I've got the uh, Nomad DTX out there. We've got uh, a nice little offshore breeze. Beautiful conditions. Got no idea what the fishing is going to be like today, but hey, it's my birthday. Got to get out here, get a little exercise, have a little fun, and enjoy this beautiful day. So hey, let's go fishing. Here we go. Nice hook up here. First fish of the morning. Yeah, it's my birthday. First fish on my birthday. There it comes. What do we got here? Nice sand bass. Woo! Oh, settle down there, boy. There we go. First fish of the morning. Actually, not a bad little sand bass. Good way to start out. All right, happy birthday to me. Back in the water, boy. There he goes. Woo! Back to the deep. Okay. Get ourselves another fish here.
Come on. It feels like a decent fish. Here we go, boys. That good of a fish, but not bad. Pretty decent sand bass. Woo! Yeah. Oh wow. This guy's barely, barely hooked. All right, second fish of the morning. This guy's looking pretty good. Let's get him back in the water. There you go, buddy. Woo, down he goes. So what's it like to be in your late 60s and uh, doing the old off the beach, open water kayak fishing? Well, to be honest with you, fishing is no problem. Paddling is no problem. Paddling through the surf is no problem. But where I can see myself having the most problems is like the end of the day when I'm tired and I've been out here all day and it's time to drag that kayak across the sand even with the sand wheels that definitely takes a toll on me that's probably one reason I like La Jolla so much is you dump your kayak right off on the beach which is, which is pretty amazing but all in all yeah I'm still able to do it how many more years I'll be able to do it We'll see how that goes. But for right now, it's definitely doable and it is definitely fun. Bit of structure on the bottom here. Let's see what happens. Whoa. Let's see what we got here. Something's going on. Like another sand bass here, sand bass city. Really not, not a bad fish. They're kind of funny, they're all right about the same size. But hey, that's three fish in a relatively short period of time there. There we go, fish number three in short order. All sand bass. Let's get them back in the water. Oh, there's got to be a bigger one out there somewhere, so let's get busy. I see quite a bit of structure today, which I guess I always see structure here, but I don't see uh, I don't see much in the way of life on top of the structure. And obviously we got three sand bows, so we know there's a few things down there happening. Oh no, we got a fish. There we go. Fish number four, this time for sure. Nice calico, actually. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Oh, that thing was stuck in my wetsuit. 
Very nice calico here. Let's get this guy back in the water. Beautiful fish. Oh, there he goes. Like a bullet. Woo, four fish in a pretty short period of time. All right, let's get back. Let's get back to it. Oh, yeah. There we go. This could be fish number five. Another nice sand bass. Woo! Nothing but keeper size today. All right, look at this guy here. Yeah, maybe the maybe the biggest one today. I don't know if he's as big as that calico though. But hey, fish number five in the books. Time for some sunscreen and snack. Go. Got a little hookup bait fish this morning. Yeah, not a bad fish. A little small though. He's actually kind of foul hook, so he's definitely not as big as the fish we've been getting on the Nomad, but a little variety. Yeah, definitely not as big. There we go, some little guy. Let's throw this a couple more times, you never know. That's a 5 8 ounce uh, red crab hookup bait. Probably my favorite all time color hookup baits, especially for spotted bay bass fishing. Another hookup bait fish here. Once again, I'd have to say he doesn't feel too big, but. Putting up a little fight here. What do we got here? Oh, actually, oh my gosh, very nice calico. I take it back. It is not a little fish. There we go, right there. Legal sized calico. That's what I'm talking about. Nice fish. On the red crab hookup bait, boy. He's a rambunctious guy. There we go. Look at that guy, huh? Not too bad, is what I'm talking about. Beautiful little fish, get it back in the water. Well, all right guys, I'm gonna call it quits early today. My wife is taking me out to a fabulous birthday dinner at Ruth Cress. Gonna get myself a giant steak and a baked potato. Uh, just in case my uh, cardiologist, Dr. Gandhi, is watching this video. Of course, I mean a tofu steak. No, I'm just kidding you, I'm going for the real deal. So hey guys, if you enjoyed this video, hit that like button subscribe and press that notification bell so you know when the latest lost horizon fishing videos are released and as always i will see you out on the water